Next tonight, a rather unsettling cyber incident. The official Twitter accounts of the Kenya Defense Forces and that of their spokesman, Major Emmanuel Chuchu, were infiltrated by a hacking group calling itself Anonymous. The hackers then posted inciting messages on the timelines of these two accounts. Security experts are warning of the dangers posed when hackers can gain control of such crucial accounts. Hackers going by the name Anonymous gained access to the Kenya Defense Forces accounts leaving a series of tweets. One of them reading, All of you who have stolen from Kenya, we are coming after you. Whether you are Kenyan or not, a thief is a thief, no matter your position. Another read, Is Kenya safe? Depends who you ask. Mamamboga and Wanjiko pay with their lives. The elite in Kenya are protected with taxpayers' money. Security expert Mwenda Mbijiwe says that criminals and even terrorists have become innovative in their ways. Magaidi wamekua high-tech kila wakati. Awa watu wako na departments kama za serikali tu. Kuna wale wavamizi wa mkono, kuna wale wavamizi wa, wa ideologies, kuna wale mavamizi, wavamizi wa mitandao ya kijamii kama hiyo. This is not the first time government communications have been hacked, with the Ministry of Transport website hacked on 5th of March in 2012. More than 100 Kenyan government websites were hacked by an Indonesian hacker. With insecurity currently posing a key challenge in the country, Bijiwe warns that such a move is dangerous as terrorists can misuse such accounts to mislead Kenyans. Or a new uh, uh, lo local militia or international, whatever it is, we are up to the task. The president should go out there and do what it, what it takes to stop these killings. This comes as the Federal Aviation Administration has issued a travel warning regarding a potential near-term attack against the U.S. and Western interests in Kenya. They warn of a possible attack using man-portable air defense systems on Kenyan soil. Such an attack was conducted against an Israeli air carrier departing from Mombasa in 2012. FAA has also prohibited flight operations in Ethiopian airspace, warning that Ethiopian forces may fire upon aircrafts crossing into Ethiopian airspace from northeastern Kenya. Sharmomani, KTN.